Hello, Mr. Ed here. <laughs> We're here. Today is August the 13th, 2016, and I'm with big YouTuber, Mr. Oh, Randy, yeah. the 628 Dirt Rooster, where beekeeping, hobby beekeeping is a what? No, way a of... Stomping roaches, you got me stomping roaches. <laughs> a way of life. Look at the... And look, he brings out some really good equipment when he comes through the job. You gotta, you gotta bring your best. That is beautiful. You gotta bring your best. He says, when these bees want to get in this box, they're going to want to get in that box. <laughs> Cucaracha <laughs> and majama. <laughs> <laughs> I like to give them a rough start, and if they survive, then I, then I want to keep them. <laughs> <laughs> Was that if they survive? If they survive, then I know they're, they're good, strong bees, and I'll keep them grabbed off of them. <laughs> I can tell you this is going to be a good good adventure right here folks. Man, Man when you got when you got a pro like this on the job, you know it's going to be good. I already got tore up by fire ants as soon as I opened that floor up. I found a colony though. Well, that's good. And and no you didn't have to use the camera, huh? No. Man. Use that's what a professional. A professional does not need that high that high tech stuff, you know, infrared, <laughs> all that stuff. I I that just, man just looks for looks for the bees and he knows where they are. I just sniffed around. I smelled them. <laughs> it took me a couple seconds, but I smelled them. So what do you call that? What you're doing right there? Is that filleting? Yeah, that's <laughs> filleting a frame. <laughs> yeah, man. Man, that's some really good looking stuff on that frame. Let me get a close up of that frame. That is like, <laughs> well, okay, well. Get a close up of some live <laughs> wax moth. Oh man, <laughs> everything is in there. There you go. Is that bait right there? That's bait. Man, look at this. Oh, that's beautiful. You named those? Yeah. Those are your pets too? Yeah, that's Shirley Wayne and... Tom. Uh, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're going to get busy here, and we're going to get this bee job knocked out. Grace of God, we're Randy's gonna, going home with some new bees. I don't know if we're going to knock it out, because there's two of them. Uh-oh. Two colonies. Uh-oh. And the one, I'm having to fight past fire ants just to get to it, so... Well, Randy. Randy so, likes to. Randy likes to start his job uh, kind of late. It's six. It's almost it's seven o'clock now, and he said he don't, don't like to get things started until late. So I don't like to start them to six twenty-eight. <laughs> so we're gonna find out how this little adventure is going. But I called in a pro. So. Um, that would not be me. Yeah, that was you. So <laughs> this should go pretty smooth. Yeah. All right. Well, here's a shot of where the bees are. It's got to be eighteen feet up in the air. But Randy says he loves working on high places. So he's gonna go up there and pull down them beak cones. And I'll be down here, I'll, I'll put them, I'll take care of them from there. But he likes to work at them heights, not like me. So I'm, I'm gonna let him do that little job. Let's do some bee wrangling. As that sun's going down, Randy's getting ready to go up on that ladder. <laughs> Nice. <laughs> That's him, yeah. He's yeah, looking back at to me as I was sunset, looking back to him. <laughs> sunset and bees are a good combination, ain't that right? <laughs> You're right. Can't get better unless they're in the box already. Well. That guy loves climbing on ladders. <laughs> I'd rather not. So I got a spot here. I get them awesome close ups. <laughs> oh, I know how you do it. <laughs> I might have to come down and get some glasses on. I think this is a dry hive.
Now they got honey in it, but I bet you it's crunchy cone. No, it's not. How about that one? Not too big? Just right. Randy, you ought to have that thing down about, oh, about four minutes. <laughs> and he'll find the queen, too. Yeah, right. <laughs> All right, we're going to get busy taking care of this stuff. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight seconds. You should be safe. <laughs> you want a I'm ahead too. The queen on that first frame he pulled out. <laughs> now it's the first brood frame. It was the third frame, third uh, third comb. He's modest. He got it the first one. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was it was so dark I couldn't even see. And he said, "There he is." I said, "God, wait." See, I wanted to play hard to get with it. I didn't want to act like I was all that, you know. <laughs> I saw it when I pulled that plywood down. <laughs> She's right in between here. I can see her right there. <laughs> when you're an old pro like Randy, you know, yeah, right. it just comes natural. Yeah, hey, I learned it from you. <laughs> you, you spotted uh, probably three times as many queens as I had, hadn't you? No. Don't even lie. No. <laughs> That's always the best thing. There she is, right there. Is Hold she? it still. There she is. There she is on top. Can you see her? Yep, I see her. See her in your camera? Yep, got her. This thing is killing me. I hate these things. <laughs> yeah, this is this is the struggle right here. There you go. All right. All right. So uh, the struggle is real. Oh, no, it's real. So uh, well, can you see us in that camera? I hope so. Can you see? So uh, that's all we got for you tonight, Randy. Six twenty-eight dirt rooster right here. You know, where beekeeping, hobby beekeeping, is a way of life. Mr. Ed, St. Joseph Abbey, and uh, thank y'all for watching. Keep Thanks on for watching. Have a good time. Me too. Yeah. Thank you, brother. <laughs>